the torch shrimp nigiri. I have avocado rolls. I have a fennel bomb roll. I have black dragon rolls. I have multiple salmon, white tuna, red tuna, spicy rolls. I have barbecue eel rolls. I have supreme crab salmon. I have supreme tuna shrimp. Supreme veggie, soft shell crab rolls, guys. I have my favorite, my double spicy salmon rolls. I have Las Vegas roll. I have so much sashimi. The list goes on. So I'm super excited. Let's dig into this. Maybe I'll throw a time up just for fun. But regardless, guys, this is going to be a lot of fun. So hopefully I can eat all this. It's a lot of food. It's over 209 pieces. That's right. Apparently, 9 is a special number, and 209 is somehow what we ended up with. So wish me luck. I'm going to need it. This is going to be good. So let's get started. All right, everyone, so uh, really, the only way, like, only place to start is just to get started eating. So I'm gonna start with some of the uh, sashimi. I think this is a good place to start. Here we got my favorite salmon sashimi. Mm. Delicious as always. We have some uh, some carrot hanging there, but mm. I'll see how much this I can get through. This is gonna be a lot. It's also like a takeout place generally. Oh, there goes my, my chopstick skills. But they know I like to eat. So luckily, I'm in here today. That salmon sashimi is too dang good. I think the hardest part of this is gonna be my chopstick skills. Mm. Oh boy, okay. Red tuna sashimi. I'm not putting any close to the camera in that. I don't want to drop that. Mm. Yeah, delicious. Got some butterfish. Also knows white tuna. Nice and buttery. I like to eat my sashimi with avocado and avocado rolls. So what I'm gonna do is pop that right in. Mix it on up in there. I get the beautiful richness, the avocado, the beautiful flavors of that fish, and all the soy sauce, all of it. Mm. I love sodium. I like it way too much, but. That's really good. That's really good. Yeah, spiralized carrots, guys. That way I always get my veggies with my orders. Hey everyone, welcome to this video. Today we're here at Sushi on Fennel in Hamilton, Ontario. Really great spot, would recommend. So here we are doing an absolutely insane sushi challenge. That's right guys, they set up the sushi challenge just for us and more specifically just for you. I read your comments and by popular request, you guys wanted me to face a challenge, which I likely would not finish, um, especially after not doing food challenges in two months. So here we are with an insane amount of sushi. Did I mention I love soy sauce? I guess I'm with Fabi. Ooh, ooh, that kicks. Cleanse my palate. Mm. Ginger just does something for me. We had a uh, spicy crab roll. Had my first piece of maki. Mm. Oh, that's spicy mayo. So good. Having some technical difficulties. Here we go. No, no. Here we go. That red tuna. I've said before. I'll say it again. Their salmon sashimi here is definitely by far one of my favorites I've ever had. It's more nigiri. I'm a big salmon person. That was the big reason why I like it so much. Same as the uh, red tuna nigiri and the red tuna sashimi. Very good stuff. They got a torch shrimp. Good. Mm. That's good. That's one of the new ones they gave me. I've never had that before. 
But I did. That could be bad. Way bad. Man, okay. There's a lot of food, everybody. I got so many items here. Like, I'm not even. I all through a tray. This is a lot of food. They might have bested me on this one. I don't even know if they'll eat all this. So I had such a variety of different rolls and uh, nigiri, um, sashimi that I mentioned all in the beginning. So I won't really dive into many of the actual kinds uh, in this commentary, but I will just speak generally. The flavors, guys, so delicious. Um, I ended up with a lot of rolls which were very, very, very rich and heavy, um, which were essentially in that middle plate and on the plate on the left of the screen. I started off eating the uh, sashimi, which probably for strategically, if I was going to look back at this and analyze it, was probably not the best thing to do, um, as all those were a little lighter on the uh, on the palate. So things are only going to get richer from here, that's for sure. Got some salmon rose, the QP mayo on the salmon. But they have so many fancy rolls and so many different options here. Um, I got to pick a number of these items, all my favorites, and they threw in a lot of extra items as well. Yep, there's gonna be a lot of food, y'all. Very good though. Where do I start? I'm gonna try one of these pockets. This is something I haven't had either. So we got like a tofu bean curry thing, a little sushi pocket. We got so here, we got some crab, rice in it. Mm. It's sweet. Okay. I was expecting that. Apparently these are a staff favorite. So I really enjoyed the opportunity to try so many different things. These pockets were really unique. I'm um, definitely some I've never had before. Whereas, you know, I had like some of my favorites, like the double spicy salmon uh, sushi, the maki there. I got um, the, the salmon sashimi, as I talked about earlier, which was great. The tuna nigiri was absolutely fantastic. Um, I really like the uh, crab rolls I got. I really like the spicy salmon, the spicy tuna rolls I got. I had just like, I had so many things, guys. Um, and like I said, I really can't say enough. They have a large uh, selection of items and I really was enjoying them through and through. Um, there's actually a video of a mukbang I did with food from this restaurant, which if you haven't seen, I'll pin in a comment down below. Definitely check that out after this video where I really take some uh, a slow depth and dive into the food. Try this fennel bomb. This roll has everything in it. Oh my gosh, that is big. Look at the size of that. Huge. Huge. This one I'm just going to use my hands. Well, that has everything there. Holy crap. The crab, the shrimp, all them sauces, tempura yam, cream cheese. Damn, that is a, a sizable roll. Look at this, compared to like that. Crazy, crazy. Okay. So. Eating, been eating for about 14 minutes. That was a lot of food. There's a lot more to come. I'm gonna try this uh, spicy cheeto roll. Wow. Got cream cheese. This is a new one. Crab, shrimp, spicy salmon. Damn. Jalapeno. Ooh, I got some kick. Wow. Whoa. All right. That's cool. Is it like hot Cheetos? I'm getting a lot more heat off this than I thought it would. Hmm. Woo. Whoa. Okay. 
This thing packs a punch. A royal punch. Very rich. Very spicy. Ooh. That's cool. I've never had hot cheetos in a sushi roll before. Would recommend. But as this wasn't an actual challenge per se, uh, you know, there was no time limits. Um, you know, so the timer is on screen just for your own leisure, guys, just for your own uh, fun, for your own involvement. And like I said, this was an absolutely insane amount of sushi. I would love for you to guess how much you think all this sushi weighed. Comment down below. Note the size of those trays and look how, like, look how wide they are comparatively to me and my shoulders. So comment down below and if somebody gets it right, I'll let them know that's for sure so let me know what you think all this sushi weighed because yes it was 209 pieces but these were huge 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 heavy heavy pieces all right so i'm trying to be strategic about what i need to get through uh i'm gonna try to get through some of these more richer rolls and then probably save more of the plainer rolls for last definitely i am noticing i'm filling up and uh like i said this is a lot of food a lot more food than i realized but Ugh, excuse me. I always say do or die. Well, I lived a pretty good life. So worst case. If you're watching to this point in the video, first off, I want to thank you so much. I really appreciate the support, guys. Also remember to like that video, it really means a lot to me, it helps me motivate to bring you these crazy videos, this best content as well. Um, but let's play a trick on the skippers guys, we've done this so many times and it's so funny. So comment down below right now guys, nice underwear Joel, because that way a skipper is going to have to come s skip or hopefully watch through the movie and figure out where in the video we're talking about my underwear or maybe you see my underwear. So comment down below guys, nice underwear Joel, thank you so much. Man I got a lot of spicy salmon rolls. And never before I've been saying that as like a, oh shucks. It's not a bad problem to have though. I will give you that. But with that, everybody, I believe that's all the uh, info, all the additional commentary I really have for you guys. Like I said, an absolutely absurd amount of sushi after I hadn't done a food challenge in about two months. Um, so this is a great way to kind of get a wake-up call. You know, I was in Mexico vacationing, not doing any videos, not working. And uh, so this was, you know, hey, back to reality, get into it. So let's see if I can finish this sushi, guys. And I'll delve into a lot more of my favorite items uh, this day and uh, a little bit more about the surroundings. But with that, everybody, thank you so much much i'll let you enjoy the rest of the video and uh ultimately let's go and see what happens slowly but surely i think we're I, I would like to think i'm at least halfway done we got a shrimp and tuna supreme roll So these are my favorite, double spicy salmon rolls. I'm gonna start breaking these back. And what is it you may ask? Spicy salmon, not spicy salmon. Halfway through these double spicy salmon rolls, I ate 
12 out of 24. We got most of a Las Vegas roll here. <laughs> Excuse me. There's nothing coming. It's coming. There we go. Feel better. One more for good luck. We got a spicy avocado, salmon, white tuna, red tuna. About half of this fennel bomb, a couple of pieces of avocado, and a couple of these sasha crab bags, and two pieces of the shrimp tuna supreme. Let's see what we can do. Things are getting tight. Mostly meaning my pants and my shirt. I don't know how far we are in. You have a time on screen. This is huge. Huge, guys. So I got a film bomb, a couple ends, and all this right here. Ugh. Let's do it, guys. I'm ready. Because you just gotta be ready. Ready now than ever. There's a. Uh, uh, this big old fennel bomb, which apparently the average person does not eat in one bite. So, I learn something new every day. But this is really good. Especially on one plate. No, I don't need the ginger and wasabi. Ugh. So, and then there were two. Bring back Pluto. If anybody gets that reference, comment down below. I'll be quite impressed. All right. Ugh. Excuse me. Ugh. Let's go going y'all oh a lot of food a lot of food how many people do you think this is normally feed <laughs> a lot 30? 30 people you know actually even at 30 that'd be like six pieces each that's pretty yeah I mean might not be too far off that's a roll each Jeez, Louise Joel, what do you be doing to yourself, buddy? Ugh. Las Vegas roll. What happens in Vegas stays in Vegas.
Ooh. Got my sinuses starting to run. That's how you can tell you're full. Fun fact. When your body wants you to stop eating, it makes your eyes water, your nose run, you stop producing saliva. Ooh. That's my body telling me you're full, y'all. We'll see what more we can do, guys. Well, everybody, I don't know how long we are in. We're definitely a bit in and eating. I'm not gonna lie. Don't know if I'm gonna be able to finish it all. Uh, see how I feel in a second. But I think I might call it quits. Because I'd rather not go to that dark zone. That would not be very fun. But I will say, everything from start to finish has been fantastic. What I have left, I have part of a Las Vegas roll, I have one order of the spi double spicy salmon, I have three little avocado pieces, and then just the ends of the black, or sorry, the uh, soft shell crab roll. Mm. Mm. I tell you, sushi on fennel, they know me really well. They know literally all everything I liked. Everything was fantastic, and they sure knew how much I could eat. Because they said they were gonna best me and buy book golly, I think they did. Seriously though, huge thanks to staff guys. Willie would recommend stopping on by. Great people. Um, order online. Like I said, it is a takeout spot, but they fill up really quickly. Uh, they're open five days a week. So I'd really recommend it. Order early if you're going for a Friday, Saturday. I always have to do it right when they open up, the orders open up for the week. But that, everybody, that's about it. Huge thanks to staff here, guys. Really delicious food. I have no words. A lot of food. Very delicious. My favorites of the day, still that double spicy salmon. One of my favorites, guys. Absolutely loved it. I really liked that hot Cheeto roll. That was really cool. And the uh, torch nigiris were really nice as well. All right, so this is what I left. The singular double spicy salmon, three piece avocado, Vegas roll, and then the little ends. Could I eat them? 